Well, it's clear. We're not in Mexico anymore. Good afternoon, amigos, from a random flea market in Orlando, Florida. <laughs> today we are uh, discovering this like world flea market thing. The main attraction today is that huge food truck park. So we're gonna see if we can find some tacos, some food, maybe from all or all across the world. We're gonna shop till we drop. Uh, let's go. I have a feeling this is where Billy works. You wanna get a massage? And your teeth, you can get a massage and your teeth whitening. No thanks. Well, at this store, we can upgrade our cell phone plan, get our teeth whitened, get a massage, get a tattoo, uh, upgrade our wardrobe, and do our Christmas shopping all in one place. Okay, Hill, give us your thoughts about this flea market. I have no words. This is the strangest. And we've been in some strange Mexican flea markets before, but this one. This takes this takes the cake for strange flea markets. We're about to go through the live animal section. Oh well, what we thought was going to be the main event was this World Food Truck Park. Typical Canon fashion, almost all of them are closed, which is uh, disappointing because they have lots of like different. All kinds of different stuff. They've got Puerto Rican, super rellenos, all sorts of Peruvian, Puerto Rican. Man, they got one place open this whole dang thing. Keep in mind it's Saturday. Super nice day out. At noon. At noon. Didn't make any sense. They even have a Mexican place. Tacos my way. It's closed. I'm not sure where our next stop is. We'll just have to just be a surprise for both you. And I, you and I, you and me, it's not just Spanish I struggle with. Well, we thought we were gonna be able to take you for some tacos here today. We're gonna have to save that for tomorrow. We thought maybe we'd get some Puerto Rican food, some kind of Latin inspired food. Now we're going to the least Mexican, least Latin place we could find. We're here at the good old Crack Barrel. We're gonna get ourselves some southern fried biscuits and gravy. <laughs> well, can you tell them about the wait time? The wait time is 20 to 25 minutes, which means 20 to 25 minutes of shopping. Oh. Now, as much as I love the food at Cracker Barrel, I'm a little conflicted about Cracker Barrel because on one hand, food is probably my second favorite thing in the world after my weta, of course. But shopping is probably my least favorite thing in the world, so it's a combination of my favorite and least favorite things. But the food makes up for it. anymore <laughs> comment below let us know if there's a place in Mexico similar to Cracker Barrel in the States in which it's like I don't know I feel like this is like super country American food and uh, let's, let us know if there's a place in Mexico that's like overly Mexican style restaurant with like a store in it I don't know if Sanborn's is kind of like that uh, Hillary's gonna start off with a small salad and then I got a soup and wait till we get her main course. So my uh, chicken noodle, or no, turkey noodle soup is pretty good. We're going light, light lunch. And <laughs> light lunch. So it's got chicken fried chicken with hash brown casserole. I'm waiting on my fried okra. Now I don't really know the difference between chicken fried chicken and like a chicken melan melanesa. Is that what it's called? Melanesa. To me it's kind of the same thing. So this is really Mexican food I think. Yeah. Uh, with my soup, I've got a house salad. You're probably wondering why. I got soup and salad. I'm hedging my bets that I wet I can't finish this. Fingers crossed. Well, well what a how is your all American lunch? I need to stop on the way home and get a few tums. <laughs> but uh, I had chicken fried chicken fried okra. It was all really good. It was pretty good. I don't know what we're gonna do now, but we're taking yeah. along with this. <laughs>
Okay, here we have genuine. <laughs> this is not fake. Genuine. Genuine canned Florida sunshine. Excellent source of vitamin D. Ingredients, Florida sun, tropical breeze, Florida air. Price? Five dollars. That is insane. Well, I've been wanting a hat to protect uh, my baby soft skin <laughs> face and I found one with my name on it. Pretty much right. What's the next stop on our We're Not in Mexico Anymore tour? We're going shopping! <laughs> yay, yay, yay. We're at... <laughs> We're at some place called Disney Springs. It's supposed to be shopping galore. So as you can tell, I'm thrilled. Me too! shopping going. This place is crazy. It is. I can't even. No words. <laughs> well, luckily we spent all our money at the hibachi last night so we can't afford anything here. This place is my worst nightmare. It's my frozen wonderland. <laughs> Escape Disney Springs without spending a cent. Not even a peso. Alrighty, amigos, today's adventure for you is coming to an end. We are at the Nike store, the one place that we might actually spend money because the shoes I'm wearing are like six years old, which in shoe, shoe years is ancient. Yeah. Uh, so we had a lot of fun today. Well, we haven't spent too much money. We haven't. It's about to change. Yes, uh, we might, uh, the next day or two, we're gonna find some Mexican food to eat, or yeah. a taco place, or we're gonna find something Mexican. We're gonna find some some type of Mexican Latin inspired food to eat for you, and yes. uh, show us. that'll make for a good video as well. Thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Check out uh, what is Have Less, Do More, Be More shirt on our uh, website, kineticinens.com slash shop. We'll see you tomorrow. Adios. Wait, did I say click the bell though? You get notified every time we upload a new video. We'll <laughs> now see, then, now we'll, we'll see, see you tomorrow. tomorrow.